Once again, thank you. Thank you that we get to engage together and we get to have some fun. So today we thought we'd have some fun down in the market and continue to grow together. Growing together is what it is all about, isn't it, Mr. Decker? Yes, it's not necessarily <clears throat> where you want to go on your journey. It's, I'm moving him over because there's oh, a bright light back it's, there. <laughs> it's who's on the journey with you that makes it really fun. And Linda's on the journey with us right now because she just joined us. Yeah, hi Linda. It is so great to see you as always. And we're hoping you're going to connect and share with us what your... Hmm, I don't want to give away the punchline already. No, but let's, let's look behind us because if you see behind us, there's fruit and vegetables. And we thought about apples. And there's apples behind us, right. but we can't get to them because right. there's this see cage here. I don't know if you can see the cage. They can. I'm going there. You can see the apples. We just can't reach them. And we were really wanting for some apples. And so we thought we'd come to the market to get some yeah. apples. And then it's well, all caged up. Yes. And so we, taught, we thought about family traditions because one of the things the Decker team has done is we've created four family traditions each year mm -hmm. for our clients and those people that refer us and we call it a family event and so when you uh, have worked with us yeah uh, the next one that's coming up is the apple picking event which is awesome it's uh, down at log cabin orchard and we uh, we give away a quarter bushel basket of apples right yeah. Hi, Stephen. Great to see you as well. And the whole family tradition thing is it's so easy to drift apart in a family. Do you see people here? <laughs> There's somebody looking at you right yeah, there. Hi. Yeah. Hi. And it's easy to drift apart. It's a drift away. And so we were discussing that. And when we first got married, mm. uh, we didn't have family traditions because we moved away from our family. And we were here in Ottawa. And actually, mm. for the longest time, all we wanted to do is move back home because Ottawa wasn't home because we didn't have any family here. And now we've established lots of family and family traditions. Right, and a lot of our family traditions are part of the Decker team family. So we do family gatherings because well, we actually really like it <laughs> and we get a chance to hang out with some of the best people that we've ever met. Hi Julie, great to see you today too and it'd be great to hang out with you as well. And so we thought how do we encourage you how do we share family tradition and how you maybe pull together versus have drifting apart it's just yeah. one of those things so we decided that even if your family's crazy right like some of our family is crazy including these yeah. ones in the family family traditions is the crazy glue that holds a family together yeah home is ottawa ottawa and area and we're going to be connecting with our family part of the decker team family picking apples and we thought you know we get to build traditions for our own family yeah and then we get to help build traditions in other people's family and it just feels really good yeah so we're going to get out in nature that's uh, actually coming up right this it coming is. saturday morning not this saturday oh this Saturday would be like tomorrow. Right. A week Saturday. A right. week Saturday we're going to get together with, uh, you know, probably 50 families and go pick apples. And it's going to be awesome because it's a tradition. It's a family tradition. Mm. And you get out into nature, get fresh air, get good, fresh, crisp apples this time of year. So it's awesome. The thinking we had was what traditions do you do and how can you build on them this year? Even if you don't live close to family, how do you create friends that are like family and create family traditions? So we've started calling the Decker team family rather than Decker team clients, although you are our client and we love that. We love getting together to have fun and yet really you've become more like family. And that started because we didn't have any here. Now we do have lots of kids <laughs> and grandkids and yet you're still, still our family. family. So what traditions do you have that maybe I would want to take on or someone else listening either now or later would like to take on? Share your family traditions because as you do, it's going to deepen the experience yeah. for everybody. Yeah, and everyone's going to get their own ideas or maybe they will just borrow your idea for what to do a family tradition in their family. And the other thing is if we missed you, if you're one of our clients or someone that's referred us and we didn't get an invite out to you, private message us 
and we'll make sure that you get an invite to our family event. Yeah, because have you ever done that? I know I've done it way too often. We Even within my little family, I sometimes forget to bite, invite somebody. Yeah, and I didn't mean special. to, but I miss somebody really special and I love them. And then they feel really left out when they hear about it like after the fact or two minutes before <laughs> it's going to happen. I don't know if that's happen. ever happened to you. It's happened to me. Way too many times. Especially a surprise party for you and I forget to invite people. Oh, that's so not a happy gig. <laughs> so if you've been forgotten somehow, you know who you are. You know that if you introduce us to people all the time, even if you've never had the chance to buy or sell or even invest in real estate yet since we met you, then you're one of our clients, part of the client family, and we want to hang out with you. Have some fun and build traditions together, build memories, because they're the best. Whether it's petting the animals at the zoo, there's a petting zoo there, or whether it's 